Like, ride with me if you ride with me, you can slide with me if you feel like 550 on the fast sticky, come get high with me, that's a deal, right? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Nicole, also known as Coley Cole. If you are new and you stumbled across the channel, over here we do a little bit of hair, a little bit of makeup. We do quite a few hauls, but most of all, we do a whole lot of living boo. It's a lifestyle channel, so if that's your vibe, click the button. Boo things, new day, new week, new vlog. We get it how we live. I think this is going to be a spend the day with me. I'm not really sure. I never know what I'm doing, so just work with me. We are, it's Friday. It's Friday. Remy Friday. You see, I was getting my life together, right? Like, I got up, I did my laundry. Um, What other product? I took my, my vitamins. I had my coffee. What else did I do this morning? Ate two boiled eggs, which I didn't burn. Yay, me. Um. Oh, side note. Those of you that know, I be burning my ball eggs because I put them on and I forget about them. My good friend, Kine, told me to stop letting them boil. Like, put them in hot water and then set it aside. So, I Google. Google said, put them in the pan, turn the water on. When the water starts boiling, put a lid on them and let them sit for however long you like your ball egg. I don't do runny eggs. So per Dr. Google, you should let them sit in the hot water for 10 minutes. So that's what I've been doing here recently. And I ain't burnt now. I ain't forgot about now. And I'm real proud of myself. I am. Because it ain't no sense that a grown ass woman like myself. The problem is, I put them on and then I forget about them. So that's why I kept burning them. Which is so childish, but whatever. <sighs> What was I saying? Okay, yeah. So, I got up and I was being productive and things. I feel like I'm ashy. Am I ashy? I think I'm ashy. Um, we're adulting. We outside. We are on our way to Total Wine. What did we just say today is? It's Remy Friday. So, we got to pick up. I need a manicure. So bad. Oh, we're on our way to Soda Wine because it's Remy Friday and we need to re-up. I don't really think I need, I guess if they got some Casamigos, we'll buy it because, you know, we ain't really been, we haven't really had our pickleback shots recently on the Remy Fridays, you know? I mean, the tequila that I got, I'm drinking it. Because I've been making margaritas and things. But we ain't really had no pickleback shots. I guess because I don't even know why. I just realized it. Don't worry. I'm going to sort it back up tonight. And then we're going to pick up groceries. Aren't y'all so proud of me? We have an HEB pickup. Not an Instacart. I'm still not adult enough to go into the grocery store. Unless it's an absolute must, which I forgot eggs 
in my pickup order. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We're going to go get our HEB pickup order. Because stuff is getting too high. Y'all, I, I don't know about y'all, but I'm finna have to find me a strip club. Um, somebody, millionaire, uncle, daddy. Because life is life right now. And, um, the bills and just the regular daily expenses is just going through the roof. And I don't really understand how stuff can continue to go through the roof. But my bank account ain't bank accounting. Like, it's regular. It's doing what it's been doing. But it, but life, life is up here. I, I'm not really sure why life's expenses are like doing this. My bank account is doing this. Help me, help me. Somebody help me figure out. What, what? I don't understand how stuff can keep going up. But, oh, there's a new Thai place. Um, income ain't unless you actually working like a Hebrew slave, and that is not the point of life to work like a Hebrew slave to um pay your beer, uh, beer, beer for you to pay your bills and necessities of life, but then you can't enjoy life because you just work to pay all of your bills and put some bread and beans in your kitchen. I just don't get it, like. What else needs to happen in life to live? I don't need to live an extravagant life. I just want to live a comfortable life without working myself to death. Because I'm not built, Lord. Help me, help me, somebody. All y'all new people out there, can y'all subscribe? Get everybody like, comment, follow me on the gram. Help me, help me, okay? Y'all can help me get to this place in life by doing those things. It's free. And when y'all do it, I get back. So, help me, help me. We can try to figure out a master plan together. All right, y'all. She said, I do the Fini. It's a best-selling cognac right now. So, ooh, says number one. We're going to go try it. All right. This is not the bottle I want this is the Ardu Fusini, family owned from uh, France and Cognac World. So this one is real well balanced, has some nice hazelnut and vanilla notes on it. Has a little oak in there, so when you're trying it, I usually drink it neat on the rocks just by itself. That's how I usually drink my Remy. Or you can mix it with some cranberry juice. Mm. Alright y'all, let's see what it tastes like. Not bad, not bad. And then this one is the VSOP. So this one has some toffee and some oak notes to it. Okay. So VSOP stands for very special pale, old pale. It's Friday. I know. Oh, my bottle was waiting on me too. It smells good. I like that one better than the first one. Alrighty. And then this is the XO. So it stands for extra old. <laughs> And it's still the Aldo Fusini brand. Now this one is highly rated at 95 points. My people that love like Hennessy um, XO, I have switched them over to the Aldo Fusini XO. Hmm. I have never heard of this brand. Yeah, it's you on just TikTok told me about too. it. Hey, if somebody put it on TikTok. Let them know that it was better than Hennessy and all that. Whew. Okay. That's smooth. Yeah. So this is made with 100% natural agave, blue agave. Uh -huh. Makes it very smooth. Ooh. So try some of that. It's got that nice warmth that stays with you and lingers, uh -huh. but it's not like a burn bite. Okay. Let's see, y'all. So let's see what she thinks. Do you want me to hold it? Oh, yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. I want to just throw it back because I only take tequila shots. Yeah. I'll make mixed drinks. Well, it's uh, it's perfect for that, really. It's not like, it doesn't hit you too hard, you know? Yeah. That one wasn't bad. And this is a Reposado? Reposado, yes, ma'am. Okay. So the Reposado is just a tier above. 
the silver. And Which it, one is best for making margaritas? So normally people use just the silver plata, uh -huh. just because it's just a basic tequila. If you're mixing it with a margarita, you don't need as, as um, high quality of a tequila. Thank you. You're welcome. Oh, Jesus. So what do you think? Which one did you like better? The reposado. Okay, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's my opinion too. And they have them on sale for $35.99 here at Total Wine. You know what? I think I'll get that today. Okay, perfect. This one, right? Resposado? Yeah. Mm -hmm. There you go. Thank you so You're much. You're welcome. Thank you. I didn't went into the wine and then left by a little tipsy. Y'all know I don't do tipsy um easily. But my little cognac pours was pretty full. And then Boo wanted to give me two tequila shots, which we bought that tequila. And then I just told y'all I ain't ate nothing but two bar eggs a day. Oh, and I live home without my wallet. Luckily, he didn't ask me for my driver's license, and they took Apple Pay, which means I can't go get my flowers. I guess I could go home. I'm trying to get everything. I'm trying to do everything I need to do, and then pick up the groceries last, because when we pick up the groceries, we got to take them home anyway. I was trying not to get them, go home, and then have to leave again. I guess I could go home, get my wallet, go get the flowers, then go get the groceries. Y'all can't even see me. Anyway. It's hot. My car say 96. 96 degrees. Which means the devil's kitchen. <sighs> they take apple pay. We got our flowers. Now we're going to get our H-E-B order. And I got to eat something. I got to choose something. Because it's really Friday. And y'all know we got to talk up. We're oh. eating lunch, guys. <laughs> Finally, so we won't be too tipsy for Remy Friday. And look at my date. What's this? Say cheese. You want to dip your chip in my cheese? Go ahead. Go. And it's hot, it's 97 degrees, and I'm still outside in all black, so that wasn't very smart. But we have a task. The main task is to not go in here and buy something that we didn't go win her for. Because it's Target, and it sucks all the dollars from you. And we're not going to fall victim today. But we are going to attempt to find, while we're in here, getting what we're getting. Um... I'm going to look in their clothing section and see if they got something I can incorporate into a piece of an outfit for Rod's birthday dinner. 
And don't even say it. Don't even comment down below and say it. You bought all them clothes for Dubai. Pick some. Make some shake. I don't want it. I don't want it. But if I can't find nothing, I guess we're going to have to figure it out. I guess I could maybe wear that jumpsuit tonight. It is just dinner. I don't know. We'll see. It's Saturday, Father's Day weekend. What are y'all doing? Comment down below. Did you go home to see your dad? Do y'all live in the same city with y'all's dads? What y'all getting y'all baby daddies, y'all's husbands, y'all's boo things? Comment down below. Tell right, me, guys. My mom needs a top or dress. And of course, she didn't come to the store. I have to figure it out. I like this dress. And it has pockets right there. But it's spaghetti strap. And we know mama ain't got no strapless bra. So I'm thinking, see it's cute, it's loose, it's flowy. I'm thinking that one, and then we'll get her this little cute top to put over it. So it'll look like a top and a skirt. And then she can wear it without the black top whenever she wants. I think so. I like it. I do. What up, what up? 